I have a question for everyone, especially the government. Uh, not that you're going to see this, but it's sometimes to just get things off your chest. Wondering when the hell this fucking economic crisis is going to end because it's getting absolutely ridiculous. I have to move because I can no longer afford my rent. But I also have no savings because of how things have been lately to help me move. So what the hell am I supposed to do? My beautiful daughter is old enough to make her own decisions. And I know this decision had nothing to do with me, but she decided that she wanted to go live with her dad for a little while. And that hurts enough. But on the other side of it, her dad is also not going to pay child support when that child is at his house, which makes total sense. But that also puts me in a financial deficit because I'm missing that money now. That I'm sorry, I had to rely on to help me. I'm not saying this to gain sympathy or anything like that. I'm saying it. To just a lot of people are in my position at this moment where they're being forced to make decisions they thought they would never have to make. There's a lot of crime in my area because of this. There's break-ins, there's people being uh, left homeless and turning to drugs to just help erase what is happening. And there's... I, there's just a lot of crime, there's a lot of theft, there's obviously lots of things, break-ins for cars, just to steal a, what change you might have left in your, your console or your cup holder or anything like that. And it's sad and it breaks my heart. But this is where we are. Nobody can afford to live. I have three dollars in my bank account right now. I have never felt the pressure so much in my entire life and my rent isn't fully paid. It's almost the end of the month. I have to move and I don't have the money to move, but I also don't have the money to stay where I am. The upside of my daughter living at her dad's right now is because I don't have the money to feed her. I am very fortunate that my partner has, he manages a restaurant so I can go to his and he feeds me. Otherwise, I don't eat very much either because groceries are too fucking expensive. This is humiliating. But this is where I am, and then I get to come to my job and put on a fucking happy face and pretend like nothing is wrong just to help these people that yell at me. Because they're feeling it too. I like my job. Customer service is hard, but I still like my job, and I work for the most amazing people. But unfortunately, they're also feeling the pinch, and they're not, not paying me what it takes to survive in today's economy and it's not their fault things just have to change